Hello YouTube, my name is Amul and in this video I'm going to show you how to add custom logo feature or support to your WordPress theme. Okay, so if you do not know how you can add a custom logo and customize it basically uh, style it wherever you, you want to float it in the center or on the right or on the left this video is good for you so let's go ahead and first add the function to enable the feature so this is a very simple feature that has just a few lines of code so I will leave this link in the description you can find it from the description area and this is the function that you need to write so double click on it I will quickly go through it so basically this is the function and then you can name the function the way you want and then these are five parameters that are being basically being passed a long argument to add theme functions theme support sorry so this is basically theme support function and you are passing these five parameters to use in your site so first one is height the second one is width the third one is flex height and the fifth fourth one is width I'll explain that in a bit and the fifth one is header text so this will let you add the site title and site description which is here which is here site title and site tagline sorry and this is site icon which appears here it's always there if you want to change it or add it's always there you just have to remove it in case if you already have and select an image so let's say I want to select this one or this one I will I can crop it if I want and then if I want to skip it I can skip it and then I'll save it this has to be 50 512 pixel wide and tall at the same time so let's get back to this custom logo so uh, yeah site title and site description now you know that the other thing is basically flex height and width will let you and enable your site to um, to deliver or render or deliver or pass whatever you call it uh, responsive images on every devices smart devices like iPhone Android tablet iPad and desktop laptops so there are a lot of things these days so um, so let's go go ahead and put this function in the functions.php so this is my simple themes folder and uh, this is my functions.php I do not have much in here um, so I'm going to add this function the custom logo support function here and then I have to change this here so I can say simple theme I do not I, I want to keep it very small like and then you just copy this one and add action or just change it to this one so also you can customize the height so let's say I want to keep a height of uh, 120 pixel and I want to keep this like 370 and I definitely want to keep the flex height and width true and this is optional if you want to okay and then you save it once saved go to header where you have to display it okay so here basically in header you already have header uh, here is the site info where you are displaying the site name and description just above that we will create a div 
custom logo that's a div and in this div we will create a, a PHP delimiter basically and then in here we will type something so if you just say like this here it's a, so to display it you simply have to say this much the custom logo that will do but if you add this extra one line of code this will this will check if there is a custom only display only then display it, otherwise don't so just copy that and paste it it's very simple otherwise if you just put the custom logo that will also work okay so if function exists this one okay only then call it otherwise don't call it so if you save it and go back to your customizer here and refresh it you will see something here on the top so go back to site identity and you will see it says no logo selected so select the logo and let's say my logo is going to be like this that looks okay just fine and then you have to uh, sorry crop it okay so I can crop it like this okay crop the image and it's here now you just have to save it and visit the home page and this will appear here okay now in case you do not want to keep it here on the left you want to keep it here in the center or on the right it's a very simple so just right click here and go to inspect element I'm using Firefox um, it's available on every browser so when you do that it selects the div where this is uh, the, the logo is okay so just open it you will see the custom logo link this is the logo and there is a lot of things so we will customize everything from here we will um, float the logo in the center and on the right as well so it's very simple just select it and press on the the plus sign here and then you will see the class has been created here now we will type in something this is basically pure CSS so let's go ahead and do that so display block and then you want to say if you select it it's already 100% okay it's 100% so if you say something like text align center it aligns in the center okay if you say right it aligns on the right so this is how you can basically align the logo in the center on the right on the left so it's very simple this is how you add a custom logo to your WordPress site or theme and this is how simple this is how simple it is to align the logo on your header WordPress theme or site header so thank you so much for watching this video please like share like share and subscribe for my channel. Thank you and have a good day. Bye for now. Take care.